Hi guys, how's it going? We are at Wellborn Stronghold in Benafjord um, to speak to Maisley regarding a quest called In the Name of Love. I hate to say it, but even though the column is dedicated to protecting its people, when it comes to deviations, we're still pretty inexperienced. That's fine. Handling deviations is my specialty. That's what I heard, that you're a real expert. Well, I've got quite a situation for you. It's like a possession. Someone who looks the same, but acts like a whole different person. I don't know what to say. I've never seen anything like it. But now, we've got our very own case here. The girl's name is Freya. She started calling herself Brianna yesterday, and insists her sister is actually her child. She won't leave her sister's side. Honestly, it's really creepy. Think I can have a chat with this Brianna? No problem. Oh, and a word of warning for you. Freya can be rather overprotective. Actually, I don't need to explain. You'll see for yourself. Okay, let's just hop down from here and speak to Brianna. Oh, I mean Freya. <laughs> Weird. Freya's not here. <laughs> Is anyone out there? That voice. Is that Valeria? What happened to you? Is that Maisley? Please help. Get me out of here. I'm trapped here. Freya locked me inside. Anyone want to explain what's going on here? I don't know what happened. Usually my sister just ignores me. But yesterday, she wouldn't leave me alone. No matter what I did. Even weirder though, she... She wanted me to call her mom. I mean... What's gotten into her? This morning, I couldn't take it. I had a big fight with her. I told her I was going to leave her to join the column, and then... You can guess what happened. She locked me in here. It seems like Freya's gotten even worse. Valeria, don't worry. We'll get this door open. Hey! Are you trying to take my child? You must be Valeria's sister, Freya. You're mistaken. My name's not Freya. I'm Valeria's mother, Brianna. Maisley? You tried to get Valeria to run away from me. This person you brought, are they supposed to help you? Freya, calm down. It's Brianna! Okay, Brianna, listen to me. No one will take Valeria. She's still young, so of course she'll stay in Wellbone. With you. But first, you need to let Valeria out. She must be getting hungry. I promise she won't run away. No way! Valeria was very naughty. She didn't finish her breakfast and said some quite hurtful things. As her mother, I need to be stern. After all, parenting requires discipline. Jeez, what kind of mother locks up her kid? That's none of your business. This is between me and my daughter. Really, Maisley, you don't know what it's like to be a mother. This world is too dangerous. Without me, Valeria would never survive. From now on, I'll keep her in this cozy little house, raising her here, safe and happy. Do not try to open this door. I'd rather my darling was never born than see any harm come to her. Why are you doing this? Because I'm a good mom. What do you think of Freya? No use talking to Freya any further. Just look at her. She can't be reasoned with. In your experience, what would be the best move? The name Brianna rings a bell. Is there a monolith nearby? Yeah, avalanche monolith. So you're saying Freya is like this because of those Rosetta bastards? Because of a great one they've contained. Something similar happened before. I'm sorry. I can handle vultures, but I don't think I can take down a great one. That's fine. We'll split up. Just leave the monolith to me. Got it. I'll keep an eye on Freya. Make sure she doesn't do anything worse to Valeria. God, that poor girl. I'm counting on you. If you run into any danger, just let me know. I'll come help as fast as I can. Alright, we are at Avalanche Monolith and we'll be fighting against the Triumph.
That was a really cool Treon cutscene for the Way of Winter scenario. Compared to the Manibus scenario, this Treon is slightly hard harder at level 30, whereas previously it was at level 20. Okay, where's the last Tangle Vine? Oh, there it is. Luxury of staying above ground like the previous scenario, that was so much easier. I'm back from the avalanche monolith. Looks like I didn't need to worry. You really are an expert. Of course I am. Things got pretty dangerous here. Freya went even crazier. Started waving around a knife. She was surprisingly strong. Even stronger than most soldiers. That said, things are okay now. So was Freya really being affected by a great one? Yes. The Treant is a monster born of maternal instinct. Rosetta seems to have done something to render its influence even more extreme. Those heartless scumbags. One day, I'll settle the score with them. How's Freya? Back to normal. Now her sister's chewing her out. But funnily enough, this whole thing seems to have helped the relationship. Life is tough. The girl's parents passed away, and Freya had to raise Valeria herself. But Freya's a proud girl, and didn't respond well to Valeria's rebelliousness. Freya didn't want Valeria to join the column, but she never told Valeria it was because... She was worried about her safety. It's likely that this desire was intensified by the Treant. Thanks to you, they've finally talked it out. We owe you for that. You've earned your reward. Dealing with family is hard enough, even without great ones jumping in. 